Okay, so the Samsung Galaxy A53 smartphone. I'm going to show you how to transfer photos and videos directly from the A53 to any Chromebook using a cable. And I'm talking about downloading the photos and the videos to the hard drive of the Chromebook. Nothing to do with the Google, tri or the Google Drive or Google Cloud, okay? Now, the first thing to note is the cable that comes with the A53. It's a, a USB-C to a USB-C. Actually, this one here. So this is the cable that comes with the phone, a USB-C to USB-C, okay? So you have to have a USB-C port or basically a Thunderbolt port on your Chromebook. So I do have a USB-C port right there. Now, the thing is, if you don't have a USB-C port, you can always use one of these little adapters here. It's a USB-A to a USB-C. You can plug that into there. Now you can plug this into your USB port, USB-A port onto your um, Chromebook. Or you can just use a USB-A to a USB-C cable. Okay, I'll just use this one. So first thing is, let me just go ahead, and I'll put the links below for this cable as well as the adapter. But I just go with the USB here. So first thing is, I'm going to plug that into my uh, Chromebook. Next, I'm going to grab my phone. I'm going to plug this in here. And now I'm going to go ahead and sign in, okay? Now check to see if you get a message, something about like allow this phone to connect to this computer. If you get that message, click on allow. Now if you don't get that message, like I didn't, what we want to do is scroll down notifications and then you want to look right here where it says USB for file transfer. USB for file transfer. Okay, so what I'll do is click this little down arrow next to it. I'm going to click on down and now it says tap for other USB options. So I'm going to tap on there. Now you can see it's on transferring file slash Android auto. It usually works like this, but now maybe it was an update from the Chromebook or the phone. I'm not sure with, with myself here, but when I tap on transferring images, as soon as I tap on that, look at the, uh, the Chromebook. So I'll tap on transferring images. And now we'll get this My Files folder to pop up. Okay, and this is exactly what we want. All right, so let me just go ahead and put the phone down now while it is plugged in. And like I said, nothing to do with this cloud backup or Google Drive. Let me just get out of that. So now if we look on the left pane here, we see this down here, SMA53SU1. That is what the name in my um, Galaxy A53 here, okay? And below that, I have two folders. I have a DCIM folder and pictures folder. Now, the DCIM folder, DCIM, is where all the photos that you've taken and videos that you've taken will go into the DCIM. So if I click on DCIM folder, now I have two cameras up, or two folders here, okay? I have camera and screenshots. Let me go to my camera here. I'm going to double-click on camera, and now you can see the photos and videos that I have here. All right, I know that there are photos. It has a JPG, JPEG extension. I know that as a video file or movie file, it has a MP4 extension, .mp4, okay? So from here, now remember, this is not a Windows computer, so some of you guys are probably like trying to get like a photo here and drag it and drop it to the desktop, and as soon as you let it go, it's gonna swing right back down, okay? The thing is because your desktop is not actually the hard drive of this Chromebook. So what we want to do is look at the left pane here. Now you see my files right here. Now everything in my files and under that is on your hard drive. So what we want to do is just make a new folder under my files and then drag and drop our photos and videos that we want. So we'll go to my files here. I'm going to make a new folder and we'll call this one um, A53. Now I got the folder A53. Now I mean I can go ahead I can drag and drop whichever one I want in here, or I can select which one, or I'll just copy the whole thing here. I'll highlight all of these here, and I'm gonna drag it and drop into that new folder I call it A53. Let it go right there. Now we should get something that says that it's copying. Oh, right down it says copying 10 items. As you can see right down here. So give this one moment. Wait till it's done copying. 10 items, copy to a53 okay so now it's copied now I can just go ahead and unplug my phone and now if we just look back here that a a53 folder let me click on that and now here's all my photos and videos that are saved to the hard drive of my Chromebook and let me go ahead and open up one of these photos or I'll just do a video here this bottom one and see what this is testing one two three one two three four five anyway you guys got the message there 
questions or issues, just comment below. All right, good luck, guys.